Even though I had been thinking about doing processions and had been making many sketches of, of what it would be like, but it was only after seeing one, seeing a grand procession in Tucson, Arizona at the old mission San Javier del Bac. And it was such a rich experience. It was at night and seeing all the native people marching in, in the procession with candles and torches and dancers and costumes. And they were people from Mexico, from Arizona, from New Mexico. And it, it was such a grand experience that right away I said, I'm going to do uh, my own procession. And I, I had my idea right away. And then uh, I started painting and I spent 14 months painting it. But the work, uh, it, 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 it's very different from the painting. I made many changes. So it's like I revisited it and I took it to another place. The perspective from the first artwork that I painted versus this new one was very different. Uh, I wanted to talk about how when I did it in 1980, many of those drawings and scenes became the, the, eventually became other artworks. This is the fisherman or the great catch, and I've done that many times. There's a big mural, a mosaic mural at the um, Concordia University in Irvine uh, that they based it on this. Then here's the loaves and fishes, which I created into a serigraph, but I revisited again. And that was a challenge, was to try to uh, make eat even these very tiny figures to have them have like a, a resolution of a very fine um, miniature. And here's even the uh, Lazarus. I've got the Lazarus story, which I showed you in the Take Away the Stone. And then the Dream of Jacob, which I've used before. But the, the main one here is the uh, David and Goliath right here which became the beginning of my other, the, the one that I did as a serigraph. As you look at all the figures as they're um, in the procession, they're with candles and with uh, musical instruments. And in the original one, it was more like a Catholic um, a procession, but I decided to make it more uh, like a, an ecumenical a procession. So instead of a, a monstrance, I put the processional cross with the um, grapes and wheat, w which represent the Eucharist. And also I put more women in the march to help bring it more to, to today where there's more inclusion. <laughs>